what's going on with you with the Hot Shot Pilot. Of course, we're here, and I know we're riding the vibe, we're doing our thing. Of course, I'm going to be um, getting out and about today. I've been out, been at the mall, and doing my fruity thing. You know, I tried some pea berries, it's pretty good. And uh, no Starbucks for me today, though. We're going to get out and about. Still haven't decided that we're going to have uh, dinner somewhere or we're going to cook at home, either way. We're going to get out and about as we, uh, you know, uh, get our exercise in, make our rounds. We're going to maybe even talk to some of my favorite folks in the mix that's around, you dig? We may even talk to some of my favorite folks um, you know, as I come and I do the bloggazines, you know, I met quite a few really cool folks, you know, as we do our thing, all the ladies. I'm going to get big ups to all them at Starbucks, all the ladies, uh, Pinkberry, it's pretty nice. Everybody's pretty nice, you know, it's just all around. Even, uh, even, uh, you know, the people that's out and about that's around that uh, look out and take care of them all. They're cool people. Uh, you know, we got a lot of great people in our area, you know what I mean? And, uh, you know, a lot of nice people. A lot of caring people, a lot of giving people, you know what I mean? A lot of, uh, you know, people that look out for their neighbors, you know, that's a good thing. It's all good, you know what I mean? But we all in this thing together. It's only one race, human race. So we all together, you know what I mean? So we got, you know, cut out the other nonsense out of work together to make sure we keep everything good. It's all good, you know? Anyway, you know, we're doing our thing, you know, I just want to give big ups to everybody and, uh, you know what I mean? Uh, everybody doing their thing. And as we're doing our thing, you know, we are riding the vibe and we're going to be, you know, checking some stuff out as we making our rounds and enjoying and taking advantage of the beautiful weather. So it's been a beautiful day today, all day long. And uh, we are going to, you know, get out and about and do what we got to do. No question about that. We get around the vibe as we do our thing, you know. We're still um, here. We're still cooling. You dig what I'm saying? Enjoying the climate, the good weather. It's great, fantastic. Um, but we're going to enjoy some more of that sunshine, too. And uh, it should be still kind of warm, but at the same time cooling off. And, uh, you know, we're always prepared. You know, I keep me a jacket. I can't go nowhere without a winter, spring, summer, fall. Uh, I keep me a jacket just in case because I never know. You know? Anyway, uh, same thing, too, is, you know, for those of us who are on a strict diet, it's very difficult to find something that's healthier to eat and won't take it too far off your diet, you know. Got a lot of great stuff, a lot of stuff, got a lot of salt, a lot of sugar. I think even if you're eating just regular stuff, you need to uh, check the content, check the label. And they're about to change the labeling too. You get a chance to see, uh, you know, the different nutrition or value of different stuff that's in the mix. You get a chance to see it, check it out. So it's all good or great. We are uh, we're gonna get out. Uh, we're gonna chill for a little while longer. Uh, we're still gonna we're gonna. Holler some of our folks as we ride the vibe on the way out to do what we're doing. We'll probably do that. And uh, get a little bit more to cool off, you know what I mean? And um, you know, I'm still debating. I'm, I'm kind of leaning more towards uh, what I'm going to cook and how to prepare to do some things the uh, day before yesterday. Yesterday, but I was fortunate enough to have one of my relatives. Uh, Cooked dinner, they grilled, uh, fantastic. Uh, you know, they went and made some of all my favorite stuff. And that's really the best meal, the meal prepared with your family and friends and loved ones. Uh, you know, with love, it's always good. You dig? You know, enjoy that. You know, you know, enjoy your family, enjoy your friends, enjoy your people that's close to you. Because like I always say, the world turns. We still on it. We woke up breathing. So, you're having a great day. You spend every day as well as your last. You never know when your time is up. So, that's why you enjoy your family. And friends and people as close to you. So you only live once. So do what you gotta do. Anyway, we wish you health, well, prosperity. You can hit me up at MTM Club Lock today at Sir Jim Bush Club Lock K. Or you can um, hit me up with that or you can uh, email me at ricovino at gmail.com and know what's going on with you and you and you as we get down in the mix. We're gonna finish this pink berry. It was delicious. Uh, it was right on time. Got a chance to cool out, have something delicious at the same time. The um, only thing, though, for the price, was it was a little bit better portion. But I guess, of course, you know, when you're in the mall, everything is pretty much gouged. That's how it is when you do your thing in the mall, you do. Anyway, I'm going to finish my, uh, you know, cooling my drink. I'm going to finish chilling. And uh, then I'm going to go ahead and, uh, you know, uh, and I guess
again, I recommend that selfie stick. Fantastic. I don't do anything without it. It helps stabilize your video, your pictures, and uh, if you don't have one, but you like me to take a lot of pictures and video, or you don't have one, get one, because it's a must-have that selfie stick if you do what I do. You dig? Anyway, hit me up. You know what's going on with you. I appreciate everybody just uh, checking out the, you know, the documentary movie on our fifth. And uh, that's strictly what we're going to be doing. We're strictly going to be hitting you with the great still photos, the videos, and also the uh, full-length uh, movies, the you know, reality entertainment, and uh, digital movies as well. Okay? We'll be hitting you with both of those. So uh, hit me up. Let me know what's going on with you. And also, you know, you can leave me a comment. You know what's going on with that. Then we'll get a check out on Xfinity Cable as well. All right? All right, get out. Let's see you. What's going on? We're going to how to show the plan. Of course, we're here. We, we're doing our thing. We're having a good time. I'm here at the mall. Had to give you a little clip, uh, you know, before I got started. Went ahead and we're doing our food thing today. I came and tried my pink berry. One of my favorite people in the mix, though, that usually make that for me. She don't, she's not there anymore. But it was all good, though. I'm going to give a big up to everybody, uh, you know, that, uh, you know, do that pink berry thing. It was cool. It was nice. Uh, the food was good, it was all good, all gravy. And uh, look like they're doing some, uh, got some renovative stuff going on in the mall. It's all good, it's cool. They're like they redoing the floors and uh, most of the food, you know, it's okay, it's decent. It's, uh, you know, a lot of it's kind of uh, overpriced, kind of, uh, you know, gouging folks. Uh, on the prices, but all in all, it's okay. It's a great experience if you want to get out, enjoy yourself, interact with your people watcher. It's a great mix to be in. Uh, your people watch, it's a cool thing to do. No question about that. And the weather's been beautiful, you know what I mean? We're gonna take advantage of all the beautiful weather, all the beautiful days. We're gonna get it to and let you know what's going on. Uh, I plan on hitting and attending all the great stuff, you know what I mean? All the uh, different events. Uh, What's going on around town? Had a good time, you know, uh, doing the outfit. That was that was cool. That was a lot of fun. And I think what I'm gonna do too is uh, we're gonna pause the cars. We're gonna come back and uh, we're gonna do more as I make my adjustment. And uh, we'll come back and get back at you. What's going on with you? How to sign a plan? Of course, we're here. You now we're gonna um, talk more about uh, technology. Um, a lot of great technology coming on up, you know, these days. Uh, and I got a chance to do the virtual. I'm a virtual guy. I love the virtual glasses, all the virtual stuff. Fantastic. And uh, I think my next uh, my next camera that I look into is going to be of everything uh, but the GoPro. And I think I'm going to get the second, uh, actually it would be a third generation drone. I um, got the first generation that was... It was okay. Um, it was expensive for the time that it came out. You could fly it from your mobile device. That was cool. The only thing though was the battery life was only like five to six minutes. The longest flight you could get would be like six to eight minutes. Then you had to either replace the batteries or recharge it. So that wasn't good. Um, I had it for a little bit. It was great, fantastic. And you do have to practice. If you're going to get yourself a drone, you got to practice on flying it because it will fly the control if you're not, if you don't practice with it. It's not hard to fly it. It's just you have to practice it so that you will know how to maneuver. you got to be able to maneuver um, so you don't crash into the wall, so you don't crash into something, you know what I mean? So, it, you know... My suggestion is if you got a big room or even better, if you can go outside, practice it. Start with a small one first, learn how to operate it, especially if you're going to do it for your mobile device. Um, I think it's better than getting uh, the Game Boy Control. You know, your mobile device is just as good as any Game Boy Control device. And um, you can fly wherever you want to, wherever you need to, which is good. But you have to practice. It's a thing that you practice on a frequent basis. The more you practice, the better you get at it. But I think that now is a pretty good time to get it in. And of course, they change the rules. If you get a, a drone over a certain size, then you have to register it. But if it's under a certain size, you don't have to register it. So that's cool. It's cool to uh, 
you know, the good ones. So that's, uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, reinvest in those. The first ones was okay. It just quite wasn't, just wasn't quite where I wanted it to be. Anytime technology comes out with new technology, it's not a good idea to buy first generation. Um, I've learned that in many phones, many electronic devices that I've purchased over the years. You got to, you know, wait till they work it all out and worry about the hype. Not to mention, um, I've had a lot of Apple products. And personally, I think they're the worst products on the market. I mean, of course, you know, I like Steve Jobs, and he's all good, he's great, but, you know, a lot of the products I've tried over the years, I've had all the different kind of phones, all the different kind of iPads, all the different kind of uh, cameras, and they really were the worst, so I don't believe the hype. Not to mention, last time I had an iPhone, um, you know, I had to haggle with my service provider and them as to replace the phone. It took them about three months to do it. And then they were only willing to replace the phone that I complained about, which wasn't good. And uh, I just uh, you know, really don't recommend them. They're the worst. I don't care what the ad campaign says. You know, you know folks got to stop going on the hype of what folks do when they've been selling you something that really is not good you know, over, the, over the years, over the decades. So it's all good. Anyway, uh, the best products on the market, and first of all, the best service provider right now, and I've tried all of them, is... Verizon, not AT&T, not uh, Sprint. Sprint is the worst, actually. Uh, AT&T is a close second. T-Mobile, um, they're like fourth. And, of course, you know, you have the other uh, prepaid ones and all those uh, different brands. But, you know, there's another company that prepaid. It was okay if you want to get something real quick. And uh, you know, the thing is, you run up your minutes. So... Verizon got good service, good quality, and you can uh, have reliable service any and everywhere you go. That's the main thing about it. That's the main thing about Verizon. You can have any and every kind of service you need and want, no matter where you are. So that's the main thing. Let's get back to devices, though. The best device to purchase to get is Samsung. Samsung is by far, and I've tried oh, almost every device, unless there's a new device that just came out that I didn't try. Um, they're the best. I mean, you got to get. Uh, they, they're always innovative. They're always, always ahead of the time in design. They were ahead of their time with the uh, webcast and video chat. Um, the uh, innovation on uh, you being able to drop your phone without the screen cracking, and where you don't have to worry about water damage. That's a big issue. If you're outside, if you accidentally drop your phone in the water and mud, and um, you know, I've tested my phones and. Uh, Absolutely fantastic. I'm dropping them won't break, screen won't crack, and then they're very water resistant. And uh, same thing with the new Sony tablet. I have that one as well. Uh, but anything, the worst, you know, you know, whatever you do, don't invest in an iPad. They're the worst. Don't invest in any Apple product whatsoever uh, because it's number height. They're okay, but uh, when it comes to service and uh, getting things uh, taken care of with your warranty, they're the worst. So I don't recommend them. But I do recommend Samsung. Anyway, we're going to talk about Opera. You know, I got a chance to do my documentary on that. That was a lot of fun. It was cool. I had a good time. Uh, the Art Fair has become an international event. It's uh, worldwide, global. There's a lot of great artists around. A lot of great artists everywhere. And, um, you know, they had some fantastic work. So if you're into artwork and into trying to get some of the best in art, they're definitely, that's definitely the place to go. If you're going to do it, go early and, uh, you know, if you can, and you, don't, you have a chair that's not heavy, take your light chair, get it. So if you're walking around and you're tired, you can go ahead and just sit down right there and there. That's a good thing. And make sure that you uh, keep hydrated. You know, this year was pretty warm, pretty hot. It was like uh, 90 degrees. It was 90 degrees every day. Uh, actually, I think a couple of days it was even 100 degrees. So it gets pretty hot, pretty hot, pretty warm. And uh, you want to make sure that you stay hydrated. It's something that you want to do and that you need to do because it gets very, very, very hot. And make sure you do that. Also, you know, you want to go early. You want to uh, pick your sections because 
you can't do it all in one day. Uh, it's, it's so big and all the streets are so massive now that uh, you can only do a few days at a time. You can only do, you know, there's so much art to see. There's a lot of food uh, to go check out, a lot of food to sample and eat. And then, um, you know, you got to rest. Uh, you know, there are places where you can cool down. There's a lot of music everywhere. And if you go check out uh, some of the documentary stuff, you can go check out some of the art for stuff. It's been fantastic. No question about that. We've had a good time as we go on the ride around the road and have a good time. And, um, Make sure you know you get out and enjoy yourself. It's definitely a fun thing to do. We uh, we ride and roller rolling and riding. We're gonna be checking out some of the different things as we're doing our thing as well. And uh, you know, we may even get around to some of my favorite people here in the mall. There's a couple uh, great cats around here in the mall who uh, got some cool stuff. You dig know what I'm saying? And we're gonna. You know, we may even uh, walk around and talk to some of them as well as we're doing our thing. It's all good, all gravy. We're having a good time, you get what I'm saying? As you see, we're here and we're live. We're gonna, uh, you know, try some more stuff. I'm gonna try uh, the Starbucks today. I tried the pink bear, it's pretty good. It, uh, you know, my homegirl uh, hooked me up, as she always do. And I had a good time. It's pretty good. It's pretty warm today, so it's pretty good to eat that yogurt. Uh, and pretty much, I've given up ice cream. I, every now and then, I may have a frosty. Other than that, uh, yogurt is better for you. Just as good as uh, just as good as ice cream. And also, you know, it's a, an acquired taste uh, on some of the different yogurts that you could buy at you know your grocery stores. But they still got some, some good brands, so I recommend that. Um, if you're trying to stay healthy, you're trying to do what you're trying to do, um, you know, switch from ice cream to yogurt. It's less fat, it's more healthy for you, it's better than uh, a lot of the other stuff that you can get. You did? Um, pea Perry, would I recommend it? Yeah, absolutely. Um, if you're out and about and you want to get something uh, tasty, not to mention the fruit, you have a selection of fruit that you can get and put on your yogurt, which makes for a better. Uh, you know, a better snack, a better dessert than just eating uh, something with a lot of sugar in it. You know, you have some nutritional value with putting fruit on your yogurt, not to mention eating yogurt instead of straight fat. You know what I mean? A lot of ice cream, so I recommend that. And believe me, take it from somebody that's on a strict diet who lost 185 pounds, it's definitely the way to go if you want to keep and maintain what you worked hard to build up, you know what I mean? You know, we're having a good time. Uh, you know, we got a chance to uh, get down to the station and uh, got a chance to get my shirt from our fair and a few pins. That was fantastic. And uh, we definitely going to wear it, too. It was uh, color coordinated with some of the stuff that I have. Fantastic. Can't be. And then I'm going to get out and about some more and uh, check some stuff out. Um, I'm decided I'm going to... Uh, do a blog and eat dinner out, or if I'm going to just go and cook dinner. I'm an excellent cook, no question about that. And then I had to tease one of my favorite homegirls here in the mall, my homegirl Summer. Beautiful girl, real nice. And a lady, you know what I mean? I had to go, you know what I mean? I'll go get out and tell her about what was going on with me and give her my email. She gave me her email and told me I hadn't emailed her yet, so I had to put the ball in her court and tell her, you know, you can email me. So I'll do it all great. They were saying we're doing our thing. I'm having a good time, though. And I am uh, going to get around in the mall uh, and, uh, you know, they have some good stuff. Uh, I was in Van Muir, and when I was in Van Muir last time, they had a live piano player. It's pretty good. It was playing a lot of contemporary music, though. And uh, as you can see on the documentary about our fate, you can see they have a lot of uh, different artists. Got a lot of talent in Ann Arbor. You know, I love the Ann Arbor lifestyle. Hometown, born and raised, fantastic. Having a good time doing that, and it's all good as we're doing our thing. We're doing time. We're having a good time. I'm going to get out in about a little while and uh, check out some more uh, what's going on out there. Uh, we're enjoying the weather. Uh, it's about 80 some degrees. It's kind of humid, though. And uh, you know, we're going to have a good time as we're doing that. And uh, we're going to check out a few of the stores in the mall as well. And uh, every day we're going to take advantage of the good weather. Good time with the nice weather. We're gonna take advantage of that and get out and about and uh, see what's going on. 
you know, I always keep me a jacket because uh, going in and out of air conditioning, you know, you go outside, it's hot. You know, you turn the air on in your car or if you're riding or, you know, you have a driver and it's kind of cold and going in and out of different stores or different businesses, you know, the air conditioning, the temperature is, you know, different. So I recommend always keep you a jacket or sweater or something. You never know when you uh, may need to warm up. You know, I like air conditioning. I don't like too much stuff. In my sinuses, uh, it's cool to have some air conditioning, not too much. Anyway, we're getting down to the mix, and we're going to be getting out and about. I'm going to go ahead and, uh, you know, chill, uh, finish my pink berry. I think I am getting a little bit hungry, so uh, I'm going to decide what I'm going to do. I'm, I'm going to eat or uh, whatever it is I'm going to do, so I'm going to decide what I'm doing. And, uh, you know, we're going to be in the mix, riding and vibing. We're going to, uh, you know, we're going to get down in the mix because we're going, I think. And uh, we're going to come back. So, you know, you keep riding, keep vibing. We're going to make some adjustments and get out you some stuff that we're doing. And we're going to see you in a little bit. Keep riding, keep vibing. As always, say the world turning. We still own it. You woke up breathing. So that means you're having a great day. And, you know, we wish you health, wealth, and prosperity. As always, tell you, make sure that you live every day as though you last because you don't know when the time is up. And don't worry about what they say and do. You know, life is short, so you get up, enjoy yourself, you have a good time. Do what you do, do what you gotta do. It's all good, it's all great, you know, right? Keep riding, keep riding. What's going on with you? How to show the plan, of course, we're doing our thing. I'm here, I'm at the mall, and we, uh, we're back in effect. I'm gonna, before I get riding and vibing, I'm gonna go ahead and, um, I'm going to uh, have my little snack, of course. I'm doing my pink berry for the day. It's pretty hot, pretty warm. You know, to have my jacket on, though, going in and out of the air conditioning, it's all good, it's all great. We're gonna make some adjustments, and uh, we're gonna come back and check you out. You know, we're gonna do the whole thing as we're doing it today. And we're riding and vibing. So, um, you know, uh, keep riding, keep vibing, and we're gonna, uh, gonna come back and check you out, let you know what's going on. Also, we're gonna get to check out the documentaries on our fair. I just uh, finished doing those, and uh, we're going to be checking out some of the other uh, events as well, too. But uh, we just want to get out to let you know what's going on with us, and as we're doing our thing, of course. Yesterday, I had to uh, catch up on all the editing. It's a beautiful day. I wish I'd have got a chance to get out there and do a little, uh, you know, a little uh, video, a little uh, shoot a movie from yesterday, because the weather was beautiful. But we're going to, you know, we're going to get together tomorrow, and... Uh, we're going to get to go to the day, and every beautiful day we're going to get out. Even if it's a little cloudy, I think I'm going to get out and about, see what's going on. But it's a beautiful day. I'm having a good time. And we're going to come back, make the adjustments on the screen, and uh, we're going to let you know what's going on with the food thing. Usually Pink Berry is pretty good. One of my favorite homegirls don't work there anymore. But all in all, it's been pretty cool, and uh, you know, we're having a good time as we ride and ride and roll and ride. And uh, I may even have some Starbucks today, too, but right now we're going to do the Pink Berry. It looks pretty good. I'm going to try the new one, Peach. And uh, we're actually getting a pretty good portion today, so let me go ahead and try it. I'm going to go ahead before it melts, and uh, we're going to come get at you in a little bit, all right? So keep riding, keep going.